Leading historians are divided over David Cameron's legacy. Renowned biographer Anthony Selden reckons that the former Prime Minister will be remembered as a patriot who worked tirelessly to keep Britain safe from attack and a giant risk-taker who resigned at the peak of his powers. Less generously, Oxford University professor Selena Todd says that Cameron brings to mind Stanley Baldwin and that the costly Brexit referendum confirmed that Cameron is an upt in a crisis, either way, there may ever be another Tory prime minister like him, because Oxford University Conservative Association has now banned young Tories from joining the infamous Bullingdon Club that Cameron was a member of. Cameron and George Osborne were both involved with the notorious all-male drinking society in the 1980s, as was Boris Johnson. Photos of the politicians posing in white tie and 1,200 pounds club tailcoats were a source of political embarrassment during their rise to power and in 2007 a picture of Cameron and Johnson posing alongside other club members was withdrawn from use by the photographer that took it. Announcing the ban, Oxford University Conservative Association Ben Etty said the Bullingdon's values and activities had no place in the modern Conservative Party. The banning of members of the Bullingdon Club from holding office in the association will, I hope, show that we are moving towards a more open, welcoming and tolerant environment for all, he added.